Hi, I'm Aishwarya and today we are here to find out who has the best work lunch order. Hint, it's me. My work lunch is generally ghar ka khana so I get a dabba from home. If I'm going to order something then it has to be a little bit unhealthy and filling and just like a treat. If my day is like crazy busy then my work lunch is going to be like for 10-15 minutes tops. But if it's like a chill day which it usually <laughs> is then I, I think I spend like at least 40 minutes like having my work lunch. Because I watch at least two episodes of whatever show I'm currently binge watching. Brooklyn Nine-Nine for the 10th time. I'm in a media company. I'm doing research. I'm missing all the work lunches that I've had with all these people in office long, long ago. Ordering lunch and then watching random things in office back when lockdown did not exist and our lives were happier. And now we don't get to do that as often, so it's kind of sad, but let's start this video. <laughs> My order is a go and curry rice with peach iced tea. I love prawns. This is a great order. I'm already into this. I will say though, I usually avoid having rice during work. Us. Rice just makes you so, so sleepy after you eat it. Like, I'll be honest, when you have a lot of rice, I just want to like have a nap. Unless you have like a bean bag next to you somewhere, then I would not like order prawn curry rice. But that's fine. Who cares about that? Who cares about work and making money? Hey, oh, this is such good prawn curry rice. That whole prawn. Mm, it's so good. I love everything about this curry. I love how tangy it is. I love the coconut milk. I feel like someone from Goa has made this or like my grandmom has made this because it's so tasty and it's so like perfectly creamy. Really good quantity of prawns in there. The prawns are perfectly cooked. I love that it's not as spicy. Like there is spice but it's not like overpowering in any sense. The curry could have been better. Not great but not bad. This lunch is more suited for like a Sunday afternoon at home but if you want to feel that vibe at work on a Wednesday, go for it. You do you. The curry is a bit salty for my taste. But it's subjective, right? Salt will be more than anyone, someone will be less than anyone. But I think this peach iced tea might help. Very, very tasty. The iced tea is a little too sweet, like most iced teas usually. I think I'll just like dilute it with extra water and have it anyway. I wouldn't order this for myself during work. Unless I'm on notice period, then sure, go ahead. I think this is Shreya's order because she does get less productive as the day progresses. So I'm thinking it's because of the rice. It all makes sense. Please don't cancel me. I can't help but give this a really, really, really good rating. A 9 on 10. I'll give this order an 8 on 10. I'm going to give this order a 6.5 on 10. My order is a Subway BMT sandwich, orange juice and a double dark chocolate cookie. And it stands for <laughs> biggest, meatiest and tastiest sub. This does not stand up to the name at all. First of all, it's not biggest for sure. And no vegetables, okay then. Who's a child in this room? I feel like Subway is such a good like sandwich place when you just want something that's like basic but you want to spend too much money. I remember I had an era in office where I was like, oh my god, I'm dieting and so I would eat a lot of Subway until Aishwarya very nicely pointed out that mayonnaise is not healthy. <laughs> I did not know that. I miss living in that era where I didn't know mayo was not healthy. I love the bread, I love Subway. Amazing salami, so smoky and so nice. How old is this sandwich? <laughs> it's not going down my throat. Did you guys not put any sauce in this? The choices of sauces are so questionable. Like very spicy and very sour and kind of weird. When you order a sub, you really need to vasool your paisa, right? But there's nothing coming out. There's not even a drip of sauce. I need my Subway to be filled with vegetables and meat and everything and that's when it's a sub. Why are you being lazy? Just eat your vegetables. Yes, sub correct nahi hai. Since there are no vegetables, I'm feeling like this is a Shreya order. I'm thinking whose Subway order was this? <laughs> so not the best, but you tried. Definitely gonna need some orange juice to combat that. Yum. I love cold pressed orange juice in general. This sandwich got my energy down and then this orange juice lifted it back up. So I feel like this is a great seesaw of energy right here in this plate. Apparently Subway cookies are very like cheap and also they are like massive. Half the size of my face. 
I'm not a huge fan of dark chocolate. To me, that's why I don't like it as much. I love a chewy cookie. I love a soft, non-crunchy cookie. Honestly, this cookie is like biting into melted Cadbury. It is super gooey and it's like super soft. Tell us in the comments which is your favorite cookie. Is it the crunchy kind or the chewy kind? But I think these are about forty to fifty rupees just for one, and for something this big, definitely worth it. I have no complaints from a double chocolate chip cookie. Like Subway does it the best. Okay, not the best, but like one of the good ones. I'm not like very disappointed with this order. I think work lunch wise, it's great. So I think this is a good order. Just the execution was a little bad, but fine. Just add more vegetables, and I'll be happy with this order. I am gonna give this order an eight on ten. An eight on ten. A seven on ten. My order is chicken fried momos, green lays, and chas. Four piece momos for lunch is very less. I just want to say that minimum two plate are like filling, I guess. Chas. This is the love of my life. It is so refreshing. It's so light. It's still so filling. Like I don't get it. It's just magic. This is my drink. This is a great wholesome order. Already in love with the person who's ordered this. Thoda zada ho gaya. I think I like them. They can be a friend. Sapne dekhne lagi thi main. Sach lagi thi wo sari baatein. Ab kya karu? Very nice momo, very nice chutney. I want to eat it right now and finish it, the whole thing, and order it again right now. You can always tell how good a momo is by its outside covering, and this one is great. It like melts in your mouth. Perfect, perfect momo. The outer covering is not as crispy for a fried momo because I think you get them delivered, and in that process, maybe they lose the crisp. But I like it because I prefer steamed momo. So this is like best of both worlds only. Oof, chaas is amazing. How can I complain about this masala chaas? There's like this big fridge outside our office where it's stocked up with chaas, and every time even one person is going out, there are two people saying, "Can you get me a chaas? Can you get me a chaas? Can you get me a chaas?" There's always on Slack quite a thing in this office, and I think Ashwarya is to blame for it. I think she would down like two, three in a day, easy. I have pictures. I can prove it to y'all. This again, I don't understand why it exists, but let's have it. That was the biggest chip I found in a Lay's cup packet. First of all, I don't go for green Lay's often, but I like it whenever I have it. Like now I'm having it, and I'm like, hmm, I should have it often probably, but I'm not going to. It's one of those things. This will go with literally anything. You give me dal chawal green Lay's, I will still think it's a great order. So yeah, beautiful compliment to this order. If I eat this, then I'm going to have to eat a snack again at 4 p.m., which is not a bad idea, but like, thoda zada de dete. I can definitely see myself uh, going like this when someone else is. Ordered this at work and like taking a bite. I don't know how all three of them go together, so I'm gonna give this a seven on ten. I think I will give this order a seven on ten. I'm gonna give this order a seven on ten. It was great, but it was not there. My work lunch order is a Moroccan spiced chicken bowl, a Kit Kat, and a Diet Coke. This is quite a bougie work lunch order. I think this is also Aishwarya's order. <laughs> I mean, it's a salad bowl. Is it just me and Aishwarya in this video? Is this a prank? Is it y'all making me try all of her favorite food because y'all know that I don't like her diet? Huh? I have a headache right now because you have zero sugar in your diet. There's some new jhar patti that's come out from the bottom. I'm not excited about a full broccoli. Did y'all even like think that maybe we should make it into smaller pieces, like maybe a piece this size? A variety of vegetables, and I have like no idea what any of these are. Is this muli? Because that's interestingly cut muli. If y'all want to sell expensive food, just have like basic food items cut into like fancy shapes. There is a cranberry next to chicken, uh, and next to that is pomegranate. Like what combination is this? Morocco wale kuch bhi khate hai kya? This is a very, very, very tasty chicken bowl. They really know how to grow their crops. I don't have thoughts only about this. I don't love it, but I don't hate it either. The chicken is really tender and so well marinated. The hummus adds a really nice garlicky flavor, in fact, which I like, and it adds it. It, it gives it like this nice moisture also. Whoever's ordered this, you probably earn more than I do. Maybe I should talk to HR about that. Not gonna lie, Diet Coke is lately my favorite beverage because it tastes like Coke, but it has zero calories. So I've been drinking this instead of water. Detox.
My diet coke, I feel enhances all of this for me because I'm such a diet coke fan. I'm like a proper proper coke head. I'm like a proper proper coke head. Diet coke head. Lately, I've been liking diet coke in general because you know I'm dieting. Let me know in the comments below if you've seen a change. <laughs> this is like really healthy, and this is trying to be healthy. They are like in the same realm of things. I love it. Tell us in the comments below if you are a break it. and eat it or do you just like munch on it already like from here are you like a weird person like that so i eat it a little bit kind of weird don't judge me but i eat it like first wafer then first wafer then the third wafer people who eat kit kat directly like that like they should be in prison shayan Also, wow! What a great uh, on-brand chocolate, huh? You're at work and you need to take a break. This person really fell for the marketing. A solid nine on ten. This is a great order. I'm gonna give this order a six on ten. A nine on ten. I'm cutting one marks because you can never be perfect. I'm glad I have converted other people's work lunch order to something super nice and convenient and not a hectic intense curry. Save that intense curry for Sunday, Shreya. Tell us in the comments below what your favorite work lunch is. अगर आप सबको ये वीडियो अच्छा लगा, don't forget to subscribe to Buzzfeed India. Hi, I'm Aishwarya, and I am here to figure out nothing. What is the video? Sorry, I've been told to finish my food and then talk. Hey, so they started giving paper straws. It used to be plastic straws, but they also wrapped it in plastic. As someone who loves prawn curry rice, I'm gonna love this either way. And if I have to nap after eating it, my manager should just be okay with that. Maybe my manager ordered this. I don't know. Uh, you know, I'm not winning. <laughs> <laughs> my order should win because it has the goodness of Goa. And who doesn't want to vacation <laughs> when they're at work, huh?